asking us for sex prematurely, meaning like a first date or any time before he's actually 100% committed to you. And I want to translate to you what he is actually saying when he's trying to have sex with you. When a man tries to have sex with you, let's just say it's a first date, which this has happened to most of us. Most men try to have sex with us on first dates. They're going to get it whenever they can, as fast as they can. So let's say he's trying to have sex with you on a first date, right? What he is actually saying, here's the translation. Do not forget this, especially you younger girls. What he is saying is, are you okay with possibly becoming a single mom because of this sexual encounter? Are you okay with possibly getting herpes or HPV or trichomonas or gonorrhea or HIV or all the other diseases that are out there, which the first three I just mentioned, you can get even with a condom, those diseases are on the skin around the genital area. so. You don't get herpes from sperm. You don't even get HPV from sperm. So the condom is not going to save you from that. So what he's asking you is, are you okay with possibly becoming a single mother? Are you okay with possibly living in poverty because of single motherhood? Are you okay with uh, maybe gaining 80 pounds during a pregnancy and never being able to lose it? Are you okay with gestational diabetes? Are you okay with dying from an abortion? Are you okay with that? Like, is that a risk you're willing to take? Are you okay with having psychological issues after having an abortion? Are you okay with possibly becoming infertile from the scar tissue you'll have from an abortion? Are you okay with maybe being a single mother of twins or triplets? Are you okay with that? For me to use your body as my tool for masturbation because I'm basically I'm going to pump you the way I do with my hand but I'd rather do it with your vaginal canal because it's more interesting to me and it's more fun and are you okay with that like taking on all those risks for me to have fun playing inside of your hole even though I've not done anything for you other than, um, you know, look cute when I showed up on this date. I bought you a steak or I took you to Red Lobster. But even then, girls, maybe you paid for your own food on the date, right? A lot of us have made that mistake. Perhaps you paid for him and he's still asking you for sex. You know these men have the nerve to do that. When a man is trying to have sex with you, he's not just trying to have sex with you. You can't just have sex and have zero risk. Even if you wear three condoms and you're on birth control, you can still 